guys and gals, what's going on everybody? It's Big E back here with you. Welcome back. Welcome back even to the Missy Mountain Gaming Channel. Now, I have purchased some thorium shells. Those are the only ones they had on the auction house. I don't know any engineers. I paid a gold 10 silver for roughly something like that. Now, I probably, what I didn't think about it, uh, what I didn't think about even, is I'm assuming we're going to get, when we trade in 200 of these, we're only going to get 200 arrows, which, you know, that's okay. Good enough, I guess. I'll buy them off the auction house uh, when I can. Or maybe I can find an engineer or something and get a better deal. I don't know, but I'm pretty sure... The guy or the tauren we're looking for is right here. He is. This is bounty hunter. What is his name? Rerick? Korlark. Korlark? Yeah. How may I aid you? Hey, brother. Go in peace. We get. Yeah. So we get 200 of these. And that is better, right? These do 17. Yeah. There's a lot more damage. Be careful. Oh, what sucks, Hail. though? I need exactly 200. So we need to hold on to these. Hopefully I can find some more. Goodbye. So in the meantime, um, we're going to have to use the regular, the arrows we've been using, which are the jagged or the red, uh, whatever they're called. Now, we hit level 52 last episode, which means training. And we're going to go get said training. And we're going to do it right now. Loktar! Ogar. Alrighty. We want men pet rank six. We want that. We are gonna want Arcane Shot seven. Scorpid Stink four. And I don't really care about any of this other stuff. Yeah, don't care about it. Dabu. Get the pet out. We're gonna go see if he has any things that to learn. And let's put this on the bar. So men pet six. So our old one restored 142 health every second. This is 189. That'll help us out a little bit there. Arcane shot seven. So our old arcane shot does 115. This does 145. And then we have a new rank of Scorpid Sting. Their old one did 385 over 15 seconds. Wait, what? Is that what I got? It is. Oh, Scorpid Sting. Ah, yeah, here. Sorry. So, Scorpid Sting. The one we had sinks a target, reducing strength and agility by 45 for 20 seconds. This reduces it by 68. A lot better quite a bit better. Let's check in with the pet trainer. How you doing, man? Pretty good. Yeah, he just has this normal stuff. But I guess why not go ahead and buy this? We have the gold to do it. Ya. I'll be seeing ya. Also, greetings, man. Is there anything else? Okay, we do have stuff. We have to be level 54. Da -da 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 -da. 54 and then 60 is what Stay we're... Stay away from the voodoo. ...is what we're looking for there. But he still only has the training points that he has. All right, very good. Um, all righty. We're all trained up. We've got a few arrows. We're going to have to buy some of the old ones. I think we can smelt up a few things. I think I've got some gold... I do have some gold. Oh, I'll have to keep those here for now. Yeah, we'll have to fill up the bags. I don't know. Maybe we just uh, we'll change these out. If we're, I don't know, trying to get an elite or something down. Maybe that's how we play it. 
We're just out solo questing, taking down regular mobs. We'll just use the jagged arrows. I've never done that before. It's the first time I've ever uh, done what we just did. Yeah. I'll try to post a few things. See if I can sell these. Uh, they've not been selling, and I've been undercutting uh, by like 10 gold just to sell them. It's not working, so I don't know. I'm thinking about actually equipping them just because they're purple. <laughs> it's not like they're bad for us. They're pretty good. Uh, let's see if there's any more. Somebody's... Yeah, they don't have them. We'll have to keep checking on them, though. Alrighty. 68. They've gone up to 68. So hold on now. Yeah, that's ridiculous. I mean, it's just too much. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to sell mine... See if I can get 25 gold out of them. Um, sell that. Anybody want that? The Mage Weave Cloth. We're good to go there. That's a loss. That's a slight uh, sale. And uh, yeah. Pet food here. Let's look for the raw. Well, it doesn't actually matter. I may as well just buy it, right? Because we're we're maxed out. So, whoops. What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> there we go. There's only five of them up there. All right. Well, what do the? Let's see if we can get the raw ones instead. Then. Yeah. This is worth it to me to uh, just do this. These are pretty decently priced, so that's plenty of food for him. We're, we've still we still have plenty of food for ourselves here. What is this? Oh, we got this in Fellwood, I guess. I don't know if I need that, but I'll go ahead and hang on to it. So the other thing I want to check for is the rune cloth. Uh, it's worth buying. This is worth it to me to spend a gold 70 to get some of these bandages. All right. Let's feed him up because we've got more coming. Sounds like Gammon just died. Give me all of this beautiful stuff. We can cook right here. Uh, yeah. Guess I get rid of that. This yellow tail. But you know what? I'll just feed it to him. Plenty of food for the pet now. And we'll have plenty of bandages. That's a lot of fish. <laughs> That's a whole lot of fish. Some might say too much. So we got the Argent Dawn uh, trinket we can equip. <coughs> when I went to the border of um, Tears Fall and Western Plague Lands, you can pick this up. You can equip it, and it allows you to acquire the Scourge Stones you can use for rep. Figured I may as well just grab it. What the hell? Why not?
if we were in Wrath with the improved uh, crafting and loot speed, we'd probably be done with this by now. It's like zip, 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 zip. That's what it's like. Only thing we're not maxed out on is uh, fishing, which we've not done any more of that, and uh, mining. We're Oh, it's interesting. We're like at the same place, exactly the same place. This mining is turning out to be kind of a pain in the ass. Uh, we're going to have to hunt specific nodes, and that's something I might do off camera. Because to get like the rich thorium and stuff, I think it said it we need to be 275, so we're a ways off there. But we only get one skill point per yellow node. Maybe a green if we're lucky. So it's gonna take a it's gonna take a while. This is a shit ton of fish. <laughs> this might last us to level sixty for him. I mean it doesn't we could do better, because he has nearly three K health, but uh, whatever. In fact, this, this the baked salmon here. We can get this from a specific fish in a couple of different places. One of the places you get it, it's uh, full of elites. It's surrounded by elites, so it's why well, I did do that. And I priced the raw uh, ingredients, and they were just stupidly overpriced. So that's why we're not feeding them that. Get this done. Make up some of these bandages. Yeah, the raw white scale. So raw, it restores 1392, which is the same as this restores cooked. But once we cook this, I think it's 29 something or whatever like that. Be a lot better for him. Actually be perfect for him. So we're going to make up all of these. And we'll have two stacks, so we'll put them right here. And then we have to go purchase uh, some jagged shells here. I wish they did they had done something different with these arrows. They look so janky, so generic. In fact, this is the exact same icon you get with your starter arrow. Like, it should be this. I don't know. I wish they had done something a little bit cooler there. Oh, that's right. It takes two rune cloth per heavy bandage here. Kind of a, I don't know, a little maintenance housekeeping episode. Usually I would do all of this stuff off camera. What I might do, if next time there's Thorium Arrows posted, Thrallhall. I might get the player's name and maybe I can send him mail and ask if he's willing to make, you know, what size slot is this? 14 stacks. And I'll just give him, 
you know, whatever it costs to make it plus a little extra. I'd totally be willing to do that. All right, so this is what we need here. Whoops. I guess... I may as well do that. Maybe I shouldn't have done that, but I did it anyway. Alrighty. For the horde. For the horde. All right, we are uh, we're set here. Food, bandages, leveled up. What are we gonna do now? Well, I tell you what we need to do. I gotta change the damn Hearthstone before I forget. So we got stuff to do in Fellwood, Unguro Crater. We can do these intro quests in here. These dinosaurs. This guy will have stuff for us to do. We could do that. And the way to do that is we have to come down to Gadget Sand, which is a hell of a fly. Uh, we did. I abandoned the hunter specific quest. One of my lovely viewers let me know it just wasn't worth it. You, Part of it is going into, I think, Sunken Temple or something to get something. He says it just wasn't worth it, so we're not... I, I went ahead and dropped that. It's actually right there. We're not going to do that. Uh, that needs to be hidden, because... I think that's like Alliance shit. So i tell you what we're going to do. We're going to Gadget Sand. And we'll set our hearth there. Well, what we'll probably do... Once we get into Ngoro Crater, we'll make our way up. Actually, is there an Alliance... I mean, a Horde camp here? This is Horde and Alliance. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. Wait a minute. Let me see. I'm contemplating where I want the Hearthstone. If I set it here, kind of in between... The problem with setting it in Thunder Bluff, there are no Zeppelins. This gets me to the other side of the world. I'm actually going to set the Hearthstone here. For right now, I guess, is what I'm going to do. Strength and honor, da boo. Boo the da. All right, let's make a little flight here. Going to be an uneventful episode. If you are an engineer, dude, I, this is so stupid to me. Hey there. Fucking hell. That you can't run over the lip without your character getting stuck right there. And it doesn't matter if you're on your mount. Even if you're not, I, you can get your character stuck just running over that. Strength thing. and honor go um, with honor. If you're watching and you are a horde engineer and you are able to make these... Thorium shells. I think it's engineers who make this. Let me know. And uh, I will happily buy these from you. You know, whatever. If you want to work something out. Mm-hmm. 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 All right, let's take a fly here. Oh, boy. A little bit sleepy. For the horde. You're a horde sickle, sir. Thank you. Da da de da da do. <laughs> that was uncalled for. That is still uploading naturally. Um, hold on, guys. I need to do this. Taking care of some business. That goes there. And I need 
to copy that. Trying to get some stuff going on for work. One of the guys I that was on my team before, the other contract I have, he said he might be able to get me on where he is. So that's kind of what I'm doing right now. See if that works out. It would just be, um, I'll say, regular programming regular coding not like uh you know bug fixing or whatever which is fine i need to get something going on yes i do i'm gonna do a quick cut scene let me remember the time or 20 minutes in. i'm gonna do a quick cut scene i will be right back with you and we do this. We go a one, a two, a skiddly diddly do. And boom, uh, we are back. And here we go. On Girl Crater for the first time on this particular character. Our Alliance boys, Mr. Mountain and Mr. Finn, they've both been through here. Yes, they have. My hardcore character, the Season of Mastery, Beardfist the Paladin, also came through here. But I believe that's it. Let me speak to this Torin here. I think this is also where you can get your own, like, uh, special raptor. I have this raptor in retail. You gotta do some stuff. I think it takes... You have to, like, take care of an egg or something? I don't really remember. But I remember doing it because I wanted the raptor. It's pretty cool looking. The winds guide you. We'll pick up Go both of these. In peace. Ancestors watch over you. Alrighty. So we're looking for some Ngoro soil, and we're also going to be slaying some raptors. Yes, we are. Raptor's going to be all over the place. Gross soil's going to be in piles. You had like a charge. Oh, that's right. Druids, feral druids, or uh, whatever the hell he is. They have uh Yeah, they have like a charge. Charge over here. Is he a Skinner? He is a Skinner. Because he knows what's up. He likes money. You got pretty low there, Night Soup. Raptor Flesh is used for a recipe. Now, we want to be careful of the elites walking around here. Pretty sure there's four. And I think they're basically in, like... Well, maybe there's three. I don't know. They walk around down here in, like, the southern areas. I think. That's what happens. We just have to watch out for them. That's all I know. All kinds of stuff we have to look out for in this area. Uh-oh. Oh, he's good to go. He's good to go. No soup. I wonder if he... You have to come back like one year. I wonder what the deal is there. We can go get this uh, little wrecked raft over here. That actually goes to where we're going to end up. Now, there's not an inn there. 
But I did set my hearth. Well, it's Ogremar. I was thinking about changing it to Gadget Sand. I, I'm fine where, where it is. Yeah. Good level range right now. And I was noticing, look how much rested XP we have. I and mean, this is where the level is. All the way down here, bro. <laughs> we have a ton. It was pretty good. Now these uh, giant devil sores, they are super, super fast because they're so big, right? They can easily, easily walk up on you and you not notice them. But I'm pretty sure the ground shakes and shit when they're walking. But still, I'd be careful. I wonder if they're being farmed here. They dropped something that's pretty good, but I don't know what it is. It's something you you use for crafting, I think. Hello there. What was that? A oh, mangled journal. Return the journal to Willidan Marshall somewhere in a girl crater. We will. We'll do that. Plenty of skins here. We could do the crystal quests if we want. Whoop. Uh. I don't think we've done it on any character on the channel. It's not. It's it's okay. Got some uh, BOEs there. Plate, stam, and strength. That seems pretty good. Let's have a quick bite to eat and get a food buff going here. That's a couple of new rank ups. A couple of new abilities. What we might actually do... Uh, well, I'll keep the Hearthstone where it is. But what we'll do is we'll fly back to Gadget Sand. If we're going to be questing here. That way, at least we can get the rested XP there. Like, keep our rested XP, I guess is what we'll do. It's a quick fly. Silithus is an area we could go to. But i got to be honest... Not my favorite area. I don't know. Maybe we do a few things in there, but I think for the most part, we'll be fell wood into winter, spring, eastern, western plague lands. Well, we'll end in eastern plague lands, I'm pretty sure, but I might not do Silithus stuff. We have two on us here, I think. Yeah. See, there's no way we're not, right? I'm a little bit low on mana here. You get some full. Doing the uh, if you run over the eggs, if you're on this quest, you run over the eggs and you get attacked. If you didn't know that, is this motherfucker gonna come for me? He is That's really fucking sucks what happened right there and we don't we don't have the tag on this because apparently she did a little damage to it All right, whatever it's 
kind of bullshit. <laughs> and it happens. Okay. Let's uh, regroup here. Let's get healed up. And let's get manned up. And then we'll work our way over here and we'll get uh, this little quest we can pick up. Pretty fun quests you can do in here. Also some pretty dangerous shit. This area down here is a nightmare. This cave can be a nightmare. Those gorillas suck. There's three different types of gorillas here. And the... So you have the thunderers, the stompers, and then the regular gorillas. The regular gorillas actually call. They let out a cry. And they... Those fucking mobs will come from hella far away. They'll call uh, for help from a long way away. Keep that in mind if you're if you're doing the hardcore challenge and you're up that way. It's like the longest call I've ever seen. We've not done any melee in a while. Oh, that's right. I forgot. You can get the Unguro, so the Unguro soil from uh, the creatures here as well. Do you want to kind of stay? Let me keep my eyes peeled. I think these things, Pat... Well, I don't remember their patrols. But I, like I said, I think there's three, maybe four of those devil sores. Around the area. Perhaps. I'll do battle with you, bro. Um, maybe we start picking up the crystals. Why not? The place where you take these, it's one of the coolest places in the game. Uh, it's all lit up. It's really cool looking. The cave you go into. It's at the back of Marshall's Refuge. The quest log is full. Interesting. Um, I'm going to abandon that. So I can pick this up. And then there's a little journal here. Which is a little bit hard to see. No, it's right here. It's a small sack. Alright. So these crystals, I think, lead to a quest where you... You can go to... The four pylons. I think there's four. Maybe it's three. There's a pylon here, here, and here. Something like that. And I think you can get different buffs. I can't really remember because it's been so long since I've, I did that quest. Those quests. We'll look into it. I'm pulling a lot here. Got another BOE, a Dagger of Agility. Might be able to sell that. I'm gonna wait to open that because it's got a bunch of crap in it, I think. Oh! No, we're not. We're looking for frogs, not toads. This is for my uh, PETA challenge.
think we're looking for frogs in the PETA challenge. We've already got toads. Maybe I'm mixed up there. I can't remember. I can't remember what level the Devil Swords are. I want to say they're 55 elites. 55, 56, something like that. Seems right. We took them down on Finn and Mountain, and we were under-leveled for both, I believe. Mountain was a hell of a lot more challenging as a warrior. It's fun, though. But we're not going to try the shit here. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you know, we get like level 58, whatever, maybe. We, we'll try it. Maybe. See if it can be done. Here's some meat for you. Or some fish, rather. It's meat. I can get a little something, something right here. Dun 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 dun. see many dirt piles unless I'm completely missing them. Also, we could do a little fishing here. See what we can fish up. See if we've got anything unique. Uh, I don't mind two mobs on us right here. Yeah. Let's take a couple of casts in here and see what we get. At this point, though, fishing, I don't know, not something we really need to worry about too much, I guess. All right, we need two more claws. Let's throw the, um, let's throw the, the bright bobble on. I don't know if I can watch my back here. Let's see what we get. I always get it confused with that. Don't have this recipe. So we can get the raw red gill here as well. Yeah, I did pick up this recipe for this particular fish. I think you can get this in Steam Weedle Port. Uh, the eastern where the dock is in Tenaris, I think. But I, I don't think the um, it's that amazing of a recipe. I didn't think it was. That's why I didn't buy it at the time. Okay, a couple different kinds. I'm almost positive that's where you get that recipe. Maybe it's good for the... No, it's not good for the pet. 
I think it's like a mana thing or something. I don't know. All right, I just wanted to see what we get there. Not too bad. Keeping an eye on the time here. So what we were twenty, we're about forty minutes in, closing in somewhere in there. Let's untrack that one. Track that one. Actually, don't need to track either one of them, honestly. We'll know when it's complete. What happens if I run over the eggs? I don't think anything happens because I'm not on the quest. If you do this on the quest, though, you'll get uh, some of these raptors run in on you. Be like, hey, man, what the hell do you think you're doing? Stepping on your eggs, bro. That's what I'm doing. Another green BOE. Holy moly. 15 stam cloth. Yeah. Okay. Pretty cool place. Another green, green zone. Like, you know, it's got like the mist and the haze. A pristine raptor skull. Seems like an archaeologist dwarf would like that somewhere in Iron Forge, maybe. Maybe a Torin. the Explorers League would be more interested in it. I think there's some Tauren who were into as far as this game to, into it. <laughs> well, you don't mean in real life? No, I don't mean in real life. What do you mean? I don't know. I don't know what the hell I mean. There's no telling. Fancy pants with the thumbnails. I do what I can. A lot of times I don't remember to get them for an episode. And sometimes I forget. Because I'm too into it. Sure would be nice to get this fucking claw. Mm-hmm. 17 damn kills now. Come on. And that's just on these. It's not That doesn't even include the runners. Na, 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 na. Red power crystal, you say. Just takes up bag space. Gotta clean out the bags here. We are quite full. Could have done that easily. We've killed these uh, nine times. Yeah. Did you quick math on that? 
9 plus, this is now 19, that's a number. Damn, I didn't know you could do math like that. Now you know. Hey there, what are you doing there, kitty cat? Hey, it's uh, Night Soup, or No Soup, rather, from Reload. It's going to be challenging for you. It damn sure is going to be challenging for you. Just remember, you can come back next month. Finish your quest. It'll cost you $15. We make challenging games here at Blizzard. <laughs> That's right. That's right, I'm a dick. If I'm ever a famous YouTuber, like so, people like know who I am, and I ever go to a BlizzCon in the future, I'm just going to wait for the perfect opportunity. I'm going to wait for the... And I promise I'll do it. Maybe I'm up on stage. Who knows? Maybe I'm being interviewed for something. I'm going to wait for the perfect opportunity, and I'm going to do my Blizzard voice. <laughs> Blizzard will probably have talked to me beforehand. They're like, look, we're going to... You know, this new expansion, we just want you to talk about it, maybe play it, but uh, we don't want you to use your Blizzard voice. If you could not do that. And I'll be like, I did. I wouldn't. I'm not going to do that. And then the first chance I get, it's going to be challenging for you. <laughs> well done. Why are you, Torin Yoda? All right. This gets turned into... Wait, what? Where does that get turned into? Oh. Ogremor. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. All right, we have kind of a journey to make here. But we need the flight point. Yes, we do. We need that flight point. This guy, I believe, is has something to do. Yeah, Ravisaur Trainer. Maybe we could do that. I don't know. I can't remember what's involved in it. I think it's just like a time thing. You have to you do a couple of things from him and then you get an egg and you have to I don't know, suck on the egg or something. I don't remember what happens, but it takes a little bit of time. And if you're the Alliance, I think, there's a something you can do. There is a parrot. This is what we need for Tyler. It's good to know they are here. Um, the Alliance, I think you can get like a Winter Saber. Something like that. And that is in Winter Spring. I remember doing that one as well. Cool looking mount. It's a really cool looking mount. We'll have plenty of opportunity to get these power crystals. Let's just get where we need to get. There's also some like elemental freaks walking around here. I think they're neutral. Stone things or something? Constructs? I don't know what they are. They're not real attractive. Those are all. So yeah, it's these freaks. And they are uh, 60 elites. So don't go right-click on them. It's not going to work out well for you. Yeah, we got parrots in here. Cool. Some of these are hostile, I think. You got the threshers and the lashers. Oh, maybe they're not. One of them poisons you or something. A little bit annoying.
This, you can see the, uh, the elite around here. So let me just kind of be careful. We're okay up here. I mean, these, uh, these apes, they're going to be higher level than us. As a matter of fact, I think some of them are like 54. Something like that. We got these freaks. Oh, I actually need those, but we'll, we'll do that next episode. All kinds of stuff we can do here. Another horrible ass fucking drop rate is from these pterodaxes. Yeah, these freaks. We need the sticky tar. We'll, so we'll probably do that next episode. What I don't know if if I log out... Okay, here's the apes. Let me be careful in here. If I log out with this amount of rested XP in a place where I'm not getting rested XP, like I don't log out in an inn, I wonder if it... Does it tick off? Does it go away? I do not know the answer to that. I'd imagine it does, but... I don't know. I don't know anything. guess we could test it. I could just look to see where it is. It's right there. This place looks cool with the ground clutter turned up. This would look like a whole different place if I turned that shit down. Why don't you turn it down? Down to funky town. Charlord. Do 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 do. I think we're full. We are full on quests. Chasing me, Amy zero one. I do not like that quest. Okay, this is like I'm right. Like we can. We're okay in here. We don't get like fucking attacked. I think you actually will get attacked from this freak. Where is he? I think you can get attacked in here. I'm wondering if they've changed it. Oh. These fucking things are hostile, man. There's Quixel. You have a quest to scare the shit out of him. Okay, we're good in here. Let's turn this in. How are you? I'm okay. Have a good one. Safe sure. travels. See you later. See you around. Turn that in. Let me open this. Well done. Thank you. Where does this go? This goes over here. Yeah, he's right here. Dude, I'm fucking nervous about being in here, man. We're being attacked. Okay, we're not we're not like flagged or anything. I don't know why I'm so freaked out. Dude, get the fuck off of me, man. Where the fuck is my uh Oh, it's on fucking CD. Can die. Explosive trap would have been nice here. I felt like I was going to be flagged. I don't know. I'm just. I'm. I don't know why I'm worried. This is so stupid. Like, what are these fucking things, man? Why are they here? <laughs> Yeah, there's like a pissed off dwarf or something over here. It's it's uh it's a spin on Mario and Luigi is what I think it is. 
Honored, I'm sure. Not really. Off and away. Here's all your shit. Very well, then. Very good. That goes to Winter Spring. Okay. Let's... Where's this selling person? He's right here. Got a little general goods vendor. You got my attention. Good. Quest item. Quest item. I don't think we need this. I'm just going to get rid of that. I don't believe we need it. I don't. He doesn't want that item. Power crystals, I guess I'm saving. Get rid of that, 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 that. We need the ungrow. Soil. Okay, a little bit of extra space. <coughs> Alright. Raw red gill. Just do that. Be awesome if you could buy the thorium things here. Safe travels. Safe travels. All right, let's get up here. I want to fly back. I don't know why I'm nervous here, but I am. I'm nervous here. Anywhere there's Horde and Alliance? No, oh, it's here he is. I thought that guy was hostile. Anywhere there's Horde and Alliance stuff, I'm just a little bit antsy. Time is money, friend. All right. Hurry back. We're going to call this an episode. Yes, we are. Thank you so much for hanging out. Next episode, we will be questing here, I'm fairly certain. That's it for this one. Thanks for watching. Take care. Beer Fist and I will catch you in tomorrow's episode. Smell you later. Peace.